Michael hired famed Hollywood private detective Anthony Pelicano, who told E.T. he questioned the boy after the charges were filed. I went and I spoke to him for approximately 45 minutes by ourselves. He absolutely said and denied that Michael did anything, uh, that didn't do anything inappropriate. Police went to Jackson's Neverland Ranch to collect evidence of child molestation. They served a search warrant on me, which allowed them to view and photograph my body, including my penis, my buttocks, my lower torso, thighs, and any other area that they wanted. The child abuse investigation lasted for more than a year, but he was never charged with any crime. He did settle the boy's lawsuit against him, saying he didn't want to drag it on and on. Pelicano ended up resigning from Michael's employ, but believed in his innocence. He said the singer is surrounded by an entourage who he believes doesn't have Michael's best interests in mind. You have to understand that Michael is a money machine, and there's all kinds of people around him that are trying to advise him. You know, those people who call themselves friends, and those people who have their own agendas. I'm very lucky and very fortunate I kept it together as long as I did.